polymers like nylon are long chains of repeating units. And we're going to form nylon right now by, by reacting hexamethylene diamine and sebacoil chloride together. I'll pour the first hexamethylene diamine into the beaker, then I'll tilt the beaker so that I can carefully pour the sebacoil chloride on top of it. They're two different densities, so the one chemical will ride on top of the other. And at the interface where they touch, they will react together and make nylon. I can reach in with a pair of forceps and pull out the nylon and begin to wind it up around the stirring rod. And as I remove nylon from the beaker, that frees up more room on the interface for the two chemicals to react, and they'll just keep making nylon until one of the two is completely used up. Can you see the nylon that we've made? Now this is the same nylon that they make fabrics out of, tents. All you have to do is dry it. You can weave it into ropes. And you can generate an awful lot of nylon from just a few milliliters of the reactants.